Hey everybody and welcome this week to Do Not Feed the Monkeys 2099. If you're not familiar with this game by chance, the original Do Not Feed the Monkeys, you invade the personal lives of people through these hidden cameras in their homes. This one's the same sort of spiel, but this time it takes place in a futuristic setting. Uh, I do have all of the DLCs um, for this game and uh, I'm ready to start it now. As usual, uh, this is a game best explained by just playing through it. Uh, because I've beaten it before, I have all these extra modes that I can play in. Uh, I'm not going to prioritize DLC cages. I just want to play it normally. And we can choose our icon for the save. I'm picking the Sad Cactus because I kind of like that one. Um, now, uh, same way as the first game was, uh, we get an invitation to the Primate Observation Club. And we have some terms and conditions, blah, blah, blah. Same shit. Basically, uh, we can't uninstall it, rule number one. Uh, we have to purchase a certain number of cages, which are actually the cameras, every five days. Um, we start at level one and uh, we can't tell people about it it's exclusive and we cannot interact with the primates remember do not feed the monkeys all right i can agree to that um at least most uh most you know terms and conditions are a little bit more than five rules but i can make five rules work surely um so to start this game off we have a sort of unique operating system. Thankfully, we only have three things to interact with. The one you'll be using the most is this triangle with a monkey in the middle of it. Uh, and with this stuff, uh, we now have four cameras in front of us, right? Uh, this one is one of the ones we'll be interacting with. Uh, did somebody just come to my door, which is on the other side? Okay, now, it looks like they just gave us a notice that uh, we will have to pay $90 tomorrow, I think, for our rent. Rent's something that we have to pay every three or four days or so. Um, I think maybe three days. Uh, so basically, you have these cameras, and you have little click onables like this one, for example. We can click on this word, or the, the satellite, the spiral, the machine. You can uh, click on all these different little things, and whenever people talk, if they have highlighted words we can also click on those as well um and we uh while these two i guess sort of yap i can go down here right and um uh this is uh like a satellite we can pull this up and we can sort of google things well you can use b scout uh so it's a search function so b scout that didn't really turn anything for us or galbrush uh but the galbrush satellite uh, it says that Tech Point, which is a video game company, is launching new infrastructure in the satellite. Um, and then we can click on all these other words. And uh, basically, there's a little story that's told in every single one of these cameras. Well, these ones are kind of like duds. This is like a how it's made sort of camera. It's a dud. This one doesn't have anything going on with it. It's just some guy working his desk job. Um, but other ones, like I said, this one here has story to it. This one here has story to it. We're getting a message here. Um, so we're installing what's called the Wee Waggle Chat. Just like the old, uh, you know, I think they called it MSN. That isn't what they called it. it. Basically just an instant messaging service. I guess the modern day equivalent would sort of be Discord. This is a retro version of it. What was it called? AOL Instant Messenger. It was a little bit before my time. Basically, this here is our lawyer. Um, and he's telling us, you know, he can give us some tips and tricks on how to interact with the, the monkeys and how to, you know, uh, you know, make, uh, the most out of our new service. So, uh, basically we can ask him a few questions like, uh, you know, he's, he's a, he's offering to help us as he was our uncle's lawyer. He's like, well, let me just say that a certain debt obliges me to volunteer to help you. Um, he doesn't really uh, say too much. Here, he's just advising you. You can see in the top right, we have some stats, food, energy, and HP. And we don't want to let those get too low. Uh, we can ask about our uncle. I don't think uh, there's much to say other than he acted very similar to the way that we're going to be acting, which is to observe primates, primates in the comfort of our own home uh, through this you know, monkey vision, I think it's called. And he says that your uncle, like all the people who came before him and his family also did this. Um, and he, uh, apparently the lawyer has been around for a very long time. Uh, we can ask about the club lastly. And something I really like is time pauses when you're in these chats. So uh, time progresses. There's a day night cycle. Uh, 
usually otherwise, but we don't have to worry about it. Um, yeah, I guess uh, that's pretty much all that there is to say to the lawyer for now. And uh, we can go back to exploring our little cameras. Um, basically, there's different ways that you can generally handle all of these cameras. Um, see, red spiral. Ooh, big dark theory. Okay, so then we can look up big dark and see what that's all about. Um, the the guardians of the vortex basically believe that the universe uh, can be construed into one big red spiral. And if we look up the guardians of the vortex, uh, the specifically the guardians of the vortex safeguard the spiral from people you know, pulling the strings, so to say. Um, now, let's do Tech Point Classic Video Game. No, that's not it. How about Galbrush Classic Video Game? Starship Monkey. So that's going to help me out here shortly. You sometimes have to search very specific things in order to get the results that you want. But now we can go ahead and call uh, Nathan Wood, who's the head over these Guardians of the Vortex. So we reach the Guardians of the Vortex, the official order of the Conspiracy Academy, blah, blah, blah. Uh, just some general boilerplate uh, welcome. He says, this is Nathan. How can I help you get closer to the truth? Uh, so we can ask, um, you know, like, hey, are you the leader or whatever? And um, uh, a lot of times, unless you're really pointed about your question, you'll just get some little side things like, what does your order do? And he's like, oh, we... Uh, there are four theories regarding the origin of the universe. How can I explain it to you? He, he's really not... Uh, it, it's like a butterfly effect he's explaining here. You know, one small thing happens and the string of the universe kind of strings it along and uh, makes big things happen. I don't really think uh, I'm going to ask any other questions because that's not as important as asking about the satellite, which has one of their mysterious devices attached to it. Uh, so he now under, he's like, oh, wait a minute. Are you actually a member of the order? Of course you are. How else could you know? Uh, um, so they're having a little bit of a problem with this device where um, they're going to blow this piece of junk, as he says, sky high. But um, they do that by launching or, or by attaching this strange device to it. But... Uh, it has a anti, um, it has a system which is preventing the hack. So uh, we can hack it, so to say, by mess uh, messaging this game sat. Uh, but to do that, let's first pull up Starship Monkeys classic video game insult duels. Now let's do Starship Monkeys insult duel. Now the reason I'm doing this just to save us a little bit of time and effort. Well, that didn't really help me out very much. Uh, uh, so we can chat with the system a little bit. Uh, and it says to start the self-destruct routine, we have to answer security phrases. Um, so he says, I've seen space monsters better looking than you. And we have to reply the appropriate insult. Uh, let's see. I've seen better space monsters better looking than you. You should have asked them for beauty tips. How's that sound? correct response lucky <laughs> sometimes you can cut like if you respond sort of normally it is randomized i think but if you respond normally or, or to the most normal uh you know grammar wise i'm the most feared space pirate everyone runs when they see me coming that makes sense no your defeat is a disgrace this must be your first one that doesn't make any sense they're afraid they'll have to talk to you if they stick around that one makes sense correct response again if it makes gram grammatically uh, grammatically makes sense like if I asked you what color is the sky and your options were red apple and uh, you know trees those wouldn't make sense you don't stand a chance I've never lost a duel that makes sense any defeat is a disgrace maybe so this must be your first one which is what I think it is you should have asked them for beauty tips now nah. so let's see if this one's it by chance all phases of the protocol pass security routine completed starting self-destruct routine so um, it's going to start blowing up here. Ooh, can I record it? Uh, I was just a little too late to buying the recording, but I don't think I could have sent it in anyway. But we did get to see it blow up, which is cool. Now, Primate Observation does send us a warning uh, that this is considered feeding the monkeys, and they don't have proof of it, but if it happens again, we will lose the game. But that's just fine, because I'm not going to do that anymore. Uh, so, I think... 
we're fine to leave cage one running that's going to be one i have to invest a little bit of time into um so here on the right side we have to feed and sleep well we have to eat and sleep maybe that's a better way to say it uh because we're not a monkey of course not uh we have all these different jobs that we can perform uh with little descriptions of what they are and what is ringing my little uh my little helper here oh this is nathan so this is like a phone also uh so the guardians of the vortex are calling uh because they have determined that the satellite exploded and he's like you had something to do with it aren't i right and we say yes uh so we put a stop to a evil force they seem to think uh and he is going to send us a extremely rare vip pass uh, we could join them if we wanted to, according to him. There's no real use for it in-game. I'll show it whenever it eventually gets here, though. Uh, what is... Oh, yes, perfect. We might actually be able to do this cage before we do the work. Let's put a pin on the work for now. I'm sorry to get off topic so soon. So, uh, I'm going to also want to buy the video recording equipment. Um, so, uh, this is a star, as we'll, we'll get to know here very shortly. This is her therapist um the star is kind of self-centered and the therapist is trying to help her work through it now her therapist has her degree in hypnotism i guess this is kind of like spoilery ish it's like do you want to explain the story or do you want to learn it with me uh this one the only reason i'm explaining it is because we're going to get it done and over with quickly uh uh, uh there's like what I consider to be a good way to deal with this one, and that's the way I'm going to deal with it. That's why we bought the recorder. So if you happen to know this game, you might, you know, know what I'm about to do. I'm not really sure the other ways you can wrap up this, uh, uh, this one. Uh, but anyway, so this woman's trigger word is Poway, or what you can see here. Uh, and now she like since she hypnotized this girl she's like tell me uh, how you feel about me exactly she's like i feel that you're an imbecile i figured that out in our first session so once again still very rude uh i don't have time for whoever's at the door okay well fuck it oh hey it's our guy with our package we'll just accept that package very quickly and then look at that in just a minute um Anyway, she says, now you get to be a chicken, and she's going to make this girl do something very embarrassing, I consider. So we'll record that, because um, uh, it even says, what would your fans say if they saw you like this? And she's like, oh, you know, uh, th this woman's like, I feel more relaxed now. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get this one out of the way, solve it. We send this into the gossip goss app, and they send us a little chunk of money, and, uh, you know, it resolves this uh, cage, which you can see because uh, uh, it'll have the pending on it. Three has been closed, so we're waiting for the resolution of uh, cage one. In the meantime, we have to get more cages because we can't just do nothing. Um, this is the Academy VIP Pass. Basically, you get sent little souvenirs, and you can sell them if you want. I'm not going to sell this. I'm not going to sell any souvenirs if I can help it. Uh, next, let's pick a job because we need to make money so we can buy food and pay the rent. We're going to do accounting intern because that one eats up the most of our time and pays the most. Uh, that's generally how these jobs work. The shorter ones don't pay as well, um, but the longer ones eat up more of your time and they pay a little better. Um, some of these are references, and I'll try my best to point them out as they pop up, if I, if I recognize them anyway. All right, so do I need food? Well, more than that... I need, how about we buy two new cages, and let's hope that's enough for right now. And then I'm going to buy, let's buy a, well, let's buy a bunch of energy berry blue blob. <laughs> My god, that sounded like I made that up almost. Uh, let's buy two of these canned meats. Hopefully that's good enough and it takes us a half hour each way i think so overall an hour to go shopping really inefficient it's much more efficient to buy um this takeout food but it's generally bad for your health like pizza minus one health damn pizza might be the way to go minus two health minus two health i don't know it's fine it's just like i don't know i, I want to keep my health up this run so uh and is there anything else i want to do it is five o'clock i don't have any more work i could do so let's just go ahead and sleep for three hours get our snooze bar up 
and then maybe I'll eat in the morning, actually, since we got food in the fridge. Yeah, eat real quick before we start sitting down at the computer. That's good. I don't need any. I don't need any more. Uh, so hopefully we got a good camera, and if we didn't, I'll just hop right back into work. Um, it's not a big deal. Ooh, we did get a new camera, but... Uh, also, we get a news update every day. Uh, Ruby Bell's popularity has dropped like a stone after we they published a video of her clucking like a chicken. Uh, her psychologist, of course, has had her license revoked. So that is camera one for us anyway, resolved. Uh, this is sort of a confusing mechanic. It's new. It's an investment app. We actually can't interact with this for a day or two. So uh, I'm just going to shelve it for now. Um, this is... Uh, our new camera that we can eventually interact with but she has a night show so I might go work a short shift somewhere because I think we'll have to pay our rent about one o'clock so which which of these jobs open the soonest 10 o'clock and eh, 10 o'clock also but six hour shift and nine o'clock so let's let's do this one this will put us at noon and then I can come back see if any cameras happen to open up by chance they shouldn't I really think that woman does a night show but I might be misremembering <clears throat> yeah I really like this game I thought it was a lot of fun it's I, I'm not gonna get all the uh, cameras in this run also you have different runs where you like be a nice guy or be a bad guy or you know do things a certain way uh, you can also like uninstall the monkey vision to get an ending uh, I'm just gonna do the good guy ending as best I can so oh nice this is our neighbor he is very annoying and very weird um, so he's asking us to help with his thesis uh, and he's like kinda from that organization sort of that we just met that are conspiracy theorists but also kinda not you can say you have no interest in helping him but he's kind of annoying but we're gonna use an item that he gives us uh, it's so basically we're what's called sleepers uh, which are people who are not awake to the truth and uh, uh, he's gonna give us a machine that's gonna kinda detect waves with us telling how good or bad we are um, and right now we're right in the middle maybe leaning a little bit good but uh, what when am I gonna pay rent hopefully here here in about 20 minutes and if they aren't here at one o'clock I think I might go work uh, is there anything else I wanted to show I don't think so let's let's take another step back um, this is WeChat this is where we can search stuff um, and like I said there's nothing we can do in these other ones right now uh, yeah they're still not here for the rent okay let's go put a couple hours in somewhere uh, sales associate six hours basically you can miss one rent payment and they'll come back the next day uh, it won't cost you any more money actually was rent even due today no it's not due till tomorrow so let's get some hours in where we can uh, nope this woman still hasn't started her night show yet I might not even work the night uh, uh, might not work tonight let's see what the hours run to eh, nine o'clock till 5 a.m. maybe surely her show won't run that late and I'll buy maybe I should mm, how long until the next one yeah nine o'clock all right let's do this let's snooze for one hour and then I'm going to we'll see if her night show started if it hasn't I'll go ahead and um, work let's see is she started her night show no all right let's go work get a little four hour shift in make 50 bucks not so bad uh, we have to have the number of cameras that we can buy at maximum oh shit there she is uh, so she holds a nighttime sort of tarot card mystique sort of stream where people can call in and ask her questions I think you have to donate to her I'm not certain it's been a little while uh, but I think this is at the end of her show the tail end might go ahead and buy two more cages real quick uh, oh yes she's getting ready to take another call wait what the hell was that hers or mine it sounded like oh wait a sec okay okay so this guy is moaning and <laughs> she's like hello is anybody there hello kitten <laughs> it's so she's got some, unfortunately some creep who keeps calling into her streams uh, I'm gonna eat real quick I'm gonna grab something to eat for this stream uh, keep our 
energy up. Uh, was there anything else? Oh, yes, we can pin streams if we like want to click between two real quick. We can. Uh, that's another feature I really like. It become it's really handy whenever we have more than one active stream. Um, I'm trying to think. I don't. Oh, yes, we just keep grabbing words from these conversations. I, I've pretty much summarized this guy. Uh, basically, again, he calls in every night and like harasses this poor ugly old woman you're right my lusty sorcerer is <laughs> he's such a loser <laughs> uh would you like to use my favorite whip on me oh my god poor <laughs> poor girl <laughs> um i wonder surely people do this in real life i wonder if they do it on like twitch and stuff this would be sort of interesting i don't really buy into the mystica stuff like this but this would be cool um i like people who like play games and stuff i've also seen on gambling apps i think where you can like gamble with real people sort of like this like you can play blackjack with a real person and interact online um i've never done it but i've seen like memes and shit of it so i wonder if somebody does surely somebody does this uh so she just hung up on him and i think that usually yeah she says that's the, that horrible call has used up all of our time all right let's do some searches here Talent, charisma versus a writer. Um, lusty sorceress. I don't know about searching that. I think there's one of these searches that can produce breasts. So if you suddenly see a sensor on the on the screen, I've accidentally searched for breasts. Uh, how about charisma writer? Some of these are really specific. I don't think I've gotten enough um, enough words for this to do this girl's quest yet so let's go ahead and sleep the rest of the night away um i have enough money for rent tomorrow i don't have enough money to eat on this sounds really sad out of context uh yeah let's sleep for one more hour um <laughs> in real life i'm doing just fine don't worry <laughs> uh but yeah so here we are uh days remaining until next evaluation three uh, so we have to have nine out of nine cameras by then and guess what we have nine out of nine the council of bureaucrats will return today uh uh nothing important on this news cycle uh just a lot of dystopian shit the science of happiness turns out money is linked to happiness damn how how depressing uh we just got a new app installed the market where we can buy stuff and send it places uh to our uh little monkeys in their cages i don't know why they would install it but it's there oh sweet this is a good well it's not a good one i actually struggled with this one the last time that i played it but i'm hoping everything goes good so i think we grabbed all the words we can from it this one's okay it's not difficult uh this this one here is a dud all right so we'll just have to be on the lookout for um one of those cages to start i'm thinking i don't think i'm gonna go out and work until later uh so who is starting oh this lame one i also wish you could like uh i understand why it dings i wish i could like mute like i could mute nine i could mute four i could mute two um you can see here in six this is like a planet that's getting terraformed that's really cool again the first game was like taking place in like a strictly like you know, only humans, only doing human things. Although well, that's not kind of true. It took place in a modern day. This one takes place in the future, which I think is cool. Uh, let's go ahead and do this one, actually. We can do a little bit of this. So if we search for Boogie Woogie, uh, we can see the Jar Fest has become more extreme than ever. Uh, tickets are selling out, and there's going to be monster trucks there, blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, shit, there's the guy who's uh, brewing up something for the... For the monster truck fest the boogie woogie and the what's it called jar fest um this guy is kind of annoying to get done right uh and if i'm able to i'll show why okay it looks like he's uh out of there if i don't have well i have to be here at one o'clock to pay rent i guess don't i and we're out of food in the fridge <laughs> uh do i have anything else going on in there now club evaluation on the same day i have to pay rent which is day six uh, I guess maybe we'll see. I don't think I can search up anything else here. Like, if I search Jarfest Monster Truck, it'll return the same. Well, it, it's some kind of, uh, you know, news article. Looks to me just about like a, uh, a Wikipedia article, which I, I appreciate. I like reading 
wiki articles. They're usually concise and factual and to the point. Uh, damn, I wish this guy had been here so I could have did his stuff. But uh, I know that these happen at regular times, all these cameras. It's just uh, they seem to happen at really inopportune times for me. This one in particular is such a pain in the ass because you have to catch this guy like right when he's fucking with this machine. And he has to be like down on his knees, I think. Um, been a little while since I did that one correctly. Where are these goobers at that want my rent? <laughs> uh, well, I'm trying to think. Maybe I... The only thing with, like, sleeping... You might be asking yourself, like, Hey, why don't you just sleep? Is, like, sleeping does not... Uh, like, if I sleep and I miss the people to pay my rent, then they'll just, like... It won't wake me up, which is kind of lame. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I could really tell you right now. Uh, oh, sweet, Ada's active. All right, I don't have to tell you anything because uh, this man is about to wake up. And you can see he's got his little computer here. And he's got a home assistant. Uh, this is a little computer that's supposed to help him out around his house. Uh, oh, yes, for the rent ladies, of course. Uh, they're reptile women. I wouldn't mind maybe wedding this one on the left, but... They're not interested in us. They're just here for the money, as usual. <laughs> uh, the w the women I, I love, they're just in it for the money. How devastating. Nah, I'm not bitter like that, for real. Uh, I'm just messing around. Anyway, uh, so this guy's a little upset with his home assistant. Um, you know, it's kind of like messing with him. It's uh, not subservient, not servile as a home assistant probably should be. Basically, imagine if you're, you asked your Alexa, like, hey, Alexa, could you turn the lights on? And it strobed them instead. <laughs> uh, okay, and we can start collecting some words. The morning words are sort of important, but the, the night words are really where it's at. Uh, is there anything else I'm missing? I, I'm going to, this one here is going to probably take place over several days. Um, the the tarot card one uh sorry i was just looking to see what the beeping was about it's this damn x-ray thing again um the uh this one here will take place over a couple of days too but that's fine because we're like way ahead of uh uh we're way ahead of things right now because we already closed one and three uh uh we got some pretty short ones all right artificial intelligence we're getting some okay words uh and it's coming up on what is that uh four o'clock i think no two o'clock right no 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 no. one two three yeah well four o'clock jesus christ <laughs> uh i didn't count on my fingers but i just about came to that <laughs> all right so is he he done for the morning yes thank god uh let's go get another shift in because we are ha hungry um uh, which one to do? How late does this one stay open? 24 hours? All right, let's do this private tutor one. Uh, I think this one's kind of cute, if I remember right. I don't think it's a reference to anything, but basically this is the student. She's like, Zo, I noticed a lot of spelling errors, but the homework is done. That's all that matters. Here's my allowance. Oh, she's paying for a tutor out of her own allowance. How sad. All right, let's get two more jobs done, I guess. At least it'll start me off... Sort well, let's see if anybody's online right now. Yeah, she's online, but um, oh shit, they're both online actually. Uh, I'm gonna have to sort of juggle these a little bit. Uh, this with this woman, despite being like a like an online personality or whatever, sees very little success, even though she gets a lot of calls. I always feel like you know, uh, so an ad android just called her and she's like, I can't help you, you don't have a soul, and uh, you know, that's how she feels about it, but it, it would be weird to me, like, you know, why would people, why would a robot watch her if they know her feelings on it? Um, whatever. Uh, now, uh, like I said, it's going to take me a couple of days to get either of these God the fucking moaning guys calling back. Uh, oh Lord. Yeah. Uh, anyway, this, uh, this guy here with his AI, um, the AI basically, uh, has like the her personality settings locked and he's like well, if you would just change your personality settings for me i wouldn't have to go all the way to the store and ask them the factory reset you but uh she's like you know 
uh, that won't be happening. I won't be. If you give me the password, he's like, yeah, I'm definitely not doing that. Could only imagine if that AI had free reign, especially since it hates that man so much. Um, let's see. I don't think, uh, nah, I still don't quite have the, still don't quite have the words that, um, I'm looking for, I, I probably needed to catch her show a little bit earlier. I also need to get some food in my belly. Um, this one here is still going off. I don't really know the best time to catch that one. Cause like, I know she does her stuff at night. This guy has a morning and night routine, but I don't know when the fuck this guy's around. Um, so she's closing down her stream. Let's go ahead and work another job. That'll put us right at the morning. Uh, like we just says, the time's changing and we have to pay rent the day after tomorrow. Sheesh. Uh, oh goodness. This is the adult lady. Uh, here's your pay and a whip as a bonus. <laughs> uh, Dolly Crow scandal. I don't think there's anything here for us. Um, ooh, new stock alert. Cool. So I think maybe now we can interact with the stocks. Uh, this is our little personal assistant, kind of like an Alexa, but you know, with a little chat GPT to it, I guess now these days. Um, here are our first investment opportunities. Uh, so create their own university degree in astronomy. Um, then, oh wait, it actually gave us all three of them. Okay, university degree, merchandising idea, museum. I'm literally, let's just do merchandising. Yeah, I, just to, I don't really understand how this works. Um, but uh, I'm fine. I'll just throw a little money at it. It's, it's not a big deal. Now you can follow how the stocks are doing on this page. Uh, like our new merchandising line supposedly is going up. Uh, oh yes, yeah, so we're hungry. I almost forgot about that. Well, let's get us, let's go to the store. You think we should? Oh, nah, let's order takeout actually. Let's order a couple pizzas. Two, three, four, five. All right, let's get five pizzas going and uh, they'll be delivered in an hour. And then if the delivery is not accepted, we will not be eligible for a refund. So don't leave the house, don't go to sleep. Let's just look around. Uh, I don't think there's anything like artificial intelligence doesn't return us anything. Uh, champions won't give us anything. I know that. Let's go to this lusty sorceress whip. Okay, phew. I'm get I'm scared every time I search for lusty sorceress because I'm like, oh god, this is like uh, red hot profit test, essential handmaiden. So what is this? A book? I'll look at that in a second. Oh, we got a package to apartment number three. Well, you can see here on the side, we're apartment number 11. I'm going to just say that's not my address. I don't know what he drops off, but probably like food or something for you. Okay. Is anybody else moving right now? Eh, nobody important. Okay. Red Hot Prophetess. What is this? Handmaiden of the Occult. I don't think this is important. How about... Oh, there's my food. Yo, uh, she survived delivery girl. She brought our disc. No, not that. Uh, she, she basically delivers everything. She's like an Amazon ups, USPS and food delivery. Uh, nice. So here's a tip for your trouble. Every time you tip your, your, um, your little morality goes up a little bit. Let's go ahead and eat two, three. God, we were hungry. We ate three whole ass pizzas. Uh, oh, this guy is moving. I still don't think anything important is happening here, but I am going to stay, I don't know, record it maybe just to see what happens. I doubt very highly that we actually, yeah, like I said, I, I think he has to be like on his knees really messing with that stuff. Um, what was I in the middle of doing? Yes, this woman. I was trying to figure out, uh-oh, uh, I need new authors to be part of Erotic Nights. Why would I call them exactly? Hold on. What if I call Erotic Nights? They're probably busy during the day. Oh, tell me. Uh, hello? Um, well, <laughs> I don't... You're calling the Erotic Nights Anthology. Uh, do you have a story for me? It depends. Can a person make a lot of money writing? Uh, I don't think any of these matter. Let's ask about this. What a joker you are. Oh, um, so I guess maybe we don't make a lot, they don't make a lot of money writing, which, you know, uh, great luck you've got. 
The Truth is such a fantastic story. So we're asking about a book of hers, the one that we can search online. Uh, well, we congratulated the author. Oh, the author is Hunter Scott. I don't really know where we're going with this storyline. The truth is, I was calling to ask you about Hunter Scott. Um, revealing his identity was the best decision they ever made. <laughs> yeah, that's wildly unethical and probably pretty fucking illegal, but whatever. Um, she'd like to marry the story. Uh, I'd love to marry that text. In fact, on planets like Kitsuyashu 35, it's now legal to marry comic book characters. Well, I mean... I, I feel the last today has been a fever dream. I'm going to look back on this recording and be like, what the fuck just happened? Um, so uh, let's hang up. <laughs> I, 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 we got Hunter Scott's name. Hunter Scott. Um, how about Lusty Sorceress? No, no, no. I think maybe if we can get called into that show, we can tell her who it is that's been harassing her. But I don't think it's necessarily <laughs> that guy. I don't know. It don't matter. Let's go get some work done. Uh, eight hours should be fine. That'll land us a little bit after eight, and everybody should be home. Uh, cool. So we got a couple hundred bucks. Oh, yes, this guy is chatting with his AI. We just need a few keywords and we'll be good. I still don't think we have all of the day and night stuff that we need. Uh, and since we're sleepy, we're now going to get a little groggy too, which is kind of lame. Um, damn. Oh shit. It's time for him to go practice. Let's see if maybe we can get the few words that were needed. Unfortunately, like the specific words we need only pop up once or twice in his dialogue. So he'll be back around 12. All right. Okay. So we know how long to sleep for. Um, so he goes out, turns out the light, let's go snooze for, let's go snooze for two hours, and then maybe that's when she'll start her night show, too. It would be nice to get two birds with one stone. I'm sorry I'm stuffed up, it's, um, uh, very hot here in America right now, uh, a little heat wave, um, and with it comes dry heat, and, uh, I also just spread some mint around my room, so I've been coughing all day, uh, so she's getting some callers. The vent hole. Who we, that's the word we needed, and we just barely got it in time. Let's do vent hole champions. Search that. Grab ham bones and go back to looking at these two. Okay, phew. Um, I was just a little bit worried that I was going to miss some important words. We definitely have a lot of new good words. Uh, is it... Well, I guess we'll look here shortly. Uh, we also need... Pa no, not password. We also need... Mm, I'm not sure which one we need. We'll, we'll get it, though, I'm sure. This woman here. What else have we got? Fortune Soothsayer. Maybe we should search that. I think she's waiting on a call, so she'll just sit there for a minute. Um, so, we got the vent hole here, which is good. Damn it, we're getting sleepy again. Uh... Let's go ahead and eat a little pizza. Oh, I bet she just got in her telephone call. Oh no, she didn't. Um, damn, I'm 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 choking here. There we are. I got it all set back up to the way that I like it. Shoo. Uh, I really like the ambiance in this game. It has a lot of really good music as the days go on too. I literally was thinking like after this recording, like recording this game, I'm going to look up and see. Uh, the OST on YouTube and add my favorite songs to it. I hope they're all not muffled like they are in game. Uh, so she's getting a caller. I don't think anything's going on here with this guy. I hope you don't consider it annoying that I flick through these, but I'm basically looking for the words. And you do have to play this game like fast, 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 which is, I don't know, it's fine. You can get a relaxed mode after you beat the game one time, which might be a little bit more like, you know, comfortable. Uh, so this guy is having trouble and she wants to get a lot of money out of him, uh, by, <laughs> see, this is kind of what I don't like about fortune tellers is a lot of times it feels like, um, they kind of, well, like tarot card readers and stuff. I don't know. I, I used to read my horoscope every day in high school and then I heard somebody give some amazing advice about it. They said, 
read the read the horoscopes that are one to the to either side like um i'm a leo so they were like read the read the virgo one and tell me if that also doesn't apply to you and i like read it and i was like shit they're right i was like and then you like read all the other ones you could read like say you know i don't i don't know like a like a random other one and they'll also apply to you and that's because they're like they just write a bunch of these and then they randomize them there's no real you know art to it and i mean sometimes people establish some kind of spirituality with themselves where they feel like they feel it which is fine um but as far as like horoscopes that newspapers and stuff print it's all automatic and that kind of was me being done with horoscopes sorry to bore you with the the tidbit boring tidbit story but um she's getting another call i'm hoping it's that lusty guy again then i can just search for random shit yeah he's moaning how about soothsayer fortune fortune soothsayer damn i think we might have to come even earlier um shit okay and then this guy still isn't back damn i'm hoping i don't choke these because that would be really lame oh you know what else i could do let's do let's do camera number eight i guess i'll uh leave this up in the background ham bones champions aha Je jeffrey td now i don't think we can message him because it is late yes he is offline all right let's go to sleep oh yeah we're gonna definitely have to sleep i didn't see quite how tired we were damn four hours straight this is gonna put us right into tomorrow i need to snooze some more take better care of my um health all my bars in general so we have tomorrow to pay the rent uh no important um news it doesn't look like uh we have three messages routine observation of primate number seven which primate number seven is the monster truck guy i have no idea what his name is uh, let's take a step back. Daily discount on Eat In. 25% off pizzas, 50% off of Mystery Stew. Interesting. And the club evaluation reminder for tomorrow. Something to remember. Now, what else am I thinking here? Um, maybe, let's see. We're doing okay on sleep. Not great. Maybe I should, maybe I should just go work today because i already got most of the morning stuff and whenever i get home i'll be able to message that guy who's having trouble with his computer uh oh shit the his his microwave must have blew up all right let's message jeffrey hi this is jeff we, and then you can see the computers in blue he's like wait we had a chat i had no idea since nobody ever talks to you <laughs> damn how sad that would be uh this computer's been working for him for weeks and this is the first time anybody's ever messaged him to chat with him and even more says like he replied pretty much immediately <laughs> uh, i'd like to speak to you alone jeffrey and the computer's like why would you want to talk to him he's a loser he's a moron <laughs> i'm smarter better looking more charismatic um let's ask about the home system uh this one should actually give us an in for the for the next important part of the the case sort of um, so he, this is the best model in his graduating class. It's all those numbers. Um, let's ask about a tournament. I doubt we'll get any more of the words we're looking for, but you know, you don't know. Uh, it doesn't look like uh, he's just excited to be bowling again. Cause he's a bowling nerd. <laughs> I guess I, I like, uh, videos of people b b bowling. I love that guy who says, who do you think you are? I am. He's very funny. Uh, I don't think, because uh, as you, like, get different prompts to ask them, you can, like, re-ask them questions. And rarely they'll have something more to say about, you know, the things that you ask them about. But it doesn't look like this one has any more. So we can go ahead and say goodbye. Um, that's that's quite enough, Jeffrey. Jeffrey the guy. Uh, oh, shit. He just entered his kitchen. He's probably not thrilled about the microwave being fucked up let me pin him oh what does she do oh my god either i kill myself or i quit all right apologies for the sudden cutoff i uh had to step away for a second yeah what the hell uh oh if you've kicked out those deadbeats yet what the fuck so it seems like he was at least joking about uh killing himself which is you know not funny but uh i'm glad to hear he's all right anyway um, 
So it's not possible for us to evict the guild. I guess somebody just missed one payment on their rent and this lady wants to evict them. I sort of forget if she's in the right or in the wrong. I think it's a guild of psychics, but I guess we'll see that soon enough. Seems that the top earning soothsayer isn't bringing in as much money as before. Hmm. And I know we've got the AI all in. I'm sleepy. Uh, it's about 7.30. And I also sort of forget how much money we have exactly. Um, I think... Uh, I was hoping she had just a little bit more to say. Ooh, but the thing is... Okay, maybe... Oh, and she still hangs up. Okay, so realtor. Wow, she looks really ugly. But she is a hag, so... Uh, useless contraption. Damn, that's not a word I need. Um, well, hold up. Uh, insolent. And you made it very clear to me from the moment I got here. Well, I needed that. But I need to know the name of this artificial intelligence. And to do that, I think I need him to say, like, home. That way I can do artificial intelligence, house, home, something like that. Um, damn. That really blows. How much food do I got real quick? Damn. That was the last pizza. That's tough. I've been putting them motherfuckers away, huh? <laughs> uh, oh, criminally. Oh, yes, get a refund from Uzink. Here we go. I can, I can make this happen. Uzink config. And then we go model number. This one. Security code is ham bones. Personality. Erase insolent. Put in servile. There we are. Perfect. So cage eight is finished. Cage five and cave six, the cage seven are gonna probably have to wait a little bit longer. I, I think I need to work and then I'll come home and go to sleep. Well, hold up. I actually have some money. Let me think for just two seconds. Maybe tomorrow's the bureaucrats and they'll be there at one to five all right all right all right let's do well who's 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 doing their thing ah fuck it let's order a pizza if we're gonna stay up for the stream uh it is funny because i sort of imagine this so, sort of like real life i don't let it get too out of hand but i'm like yeah this reminds me of a time whenever i like had an apartment and i'd be like yeah okay let's just get let's get a little snack prepared for tonight's stream all right, so they'll be here in about an hour, and I also just got an achievement for uh, buying during sales. Ooh, Cassandra. Uh, Cassandra's the name of this lady, it appears. Uh, should I murder the widow, or the tightrope walker in her hat? <laughs> Is this part of the show? An excellent blunt. Oh, I'll buy sulfuric acid wool, weaving the rugs in her work. <laughs> I don't know about all of that. Cassandra Soothsayer. Aha, Abra Cassandra. Um, how about Guild? Damn it. Oh, hey, here's my food, probably. Brick us together delivery, girl. Wow, sort of cute. Uh, you look a little blocky, but whatever. Uh, three buck tip. That seems almost insulting, but hey, you know. Now let's eat. Uh... Let's buy or eat the meat first. Throw pizza in the air fryer real quick. Uh, so, Abra Cassandra. Now, I'm supposed to call her while she's on the air, I'm pretty sure. So, I'm just going to uh, look here. Let's call. I think I can call her. We still have time for more calls. Hold up. Maybe I should. Oh, you know when it is? It's while she's like taking a break while she's not lit up. That's what it is. So now we should be able to call. Uh, okay. Welcome to Abra Cassandra. <laughs> uh, I'd like to talk about your website. I know that someone's been harassing you. I want to talk about an erotic story. What? I was calling to talk to you about a literal anthology that's going to be published. Okay. What a great discovery. Uh... <laughs> Are you insinuating that you have more power than I do? I don't feel right about tormenting mortals. Uh, friends, beware of these charlatans. Uh, damn. Okay, okay. So we, I guess, have to call her while she's not on stream. I guess. Uh, I guess I'll just hang up. All right. 
so sleep. Yes, let's do some sleeping. Let's sleep nine hours. Get a good old snooze in. You get one of them nine hour sleeps in real life and hot dog, you feel like a new person. Eh, another hour sleep. And then we'll, we'll say that's good. I got plenty of food in the fridge now, which is nice. That'll probably last me s several days. Uh, nine out of nine cameras. The council returns today, and we passed evaluation. So, um, none of these are very important for us. Cage 8 has been changed to closed. What? Daily discount on Eden. Oh, nice. Oh, she's, uh, oh, I forgot the, uh, Eden Delivery Girl's the one who mails us these, uh, coupons and stuff. Congratulations, we got promoted. Multivision cages. Oh, I hate multivision cages. Uh, starting now, you can unlock night vision for 25 bucks. I could buy that. I think as soon as I actually need night vision, I'll probably buy it. Okay, what is the next plan? Can I call Cassandra? Um, no. I'm not, maybe I'll call her a little later. 10 o'clock currently, right? And I don't need to eat. Mm, if I wasn't waiting on the council, I would consider going and doing some work for the day. In the meantime, maybe I should... Cage 8 is done. Let's look at Cage 5 a little bit more. Um, Deadbeat Guild. How about, ooh, Soothsayer Guild, because they mentioned that. Damn. Fortune Teller License Guild. Oh, okay. Guild of Psychics. Haha. -ha. And then what is activated? Nope. No. Neither one of those are important. So... Psychics Guild. Is there anything they could really tell us? Probably not. Psychics? No. Mm, I think, honestly, that's... I don't know that there's much I can do until Cassandra is available to be called. Um, damn, shame I still can't work on that guy. Lame. He might go undone. I hope not, because that would be lame, but... I'd do most of the other ones, so it's not too bad. Hey, how about... Oh, shit, there she is. Very cool. Uh, all right. Hello, Cassandra. Um, now, heard that you're not happy with the association you belong to. I know who the pervert who calls your shows is. Uh, thank goodness, I've been looking for a way to rid him for months. If I had his name, surely I could get him off my back. Uh, uh, don't worry about it. Okay. Uh... I was just thinking, wait, uh, damn it, no, we'll just say that we want him to get what he deserves, I got plenty of money, anyway, uh, Hunter Scott, I have you now, you foul homunculus, <laughs> oh boy, okay, to make my next live stream a midnight special, okay, so midnight, uh, we could report back. Oh, cage five has been changed depending. I guess we won't see anything about the Psychic meeting man. Yeah, we got about an hour until uh, you know what I could sleep that hour away now that I think about it um, Then we'll have the council here Then we'll go put in some hours working yada yada um, Oh, is that them already? Oh god. It's our goofy neighbor uh Measuring our progress. Oh, yeah, we're very happy right now. He's teaching us about the five M's. There are five pillars that support every hypothesis. Uh, I, it's just some more fucking gobbledygook. Future conspiracy theory gobbledygook. If I was scheming against someone, I'd keep an eye on them. Um, I guess. Uh, well, at least he likes our conclusion. And we probably just gotta little happier because of that nice I saw the little heart before we moved all right one o'clock hopefully they'll be visiting us shortly hmm okay in the meantime maybe I should search some more about Jarfest monster truck how about monster truck probably not barrels uh nah. monster truck bathtub boogie woogie bathtub damn you would think <laughs> Uh, how about bo just boogie woogie? Now, uh, cage seven. Yeah, that's this guy. I don't know what I can really do about that. What has been a time I have not been here, basically? Oh, yeah, you can see the new way that this guy's 
house AI treats him, which is, that is to say, a lot better. <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm not used to the new you who's so nice. And it's, I think this calls him like cupcake or pumpkin a lot. Uh, so it's weird for him. I do kind of want to see... If you prefer, I can mute myself. I don't know. Not only is it weird for a computer to fall in love with you, but a house. I think they did a TV show like that, but where I thought it was the mom. I never watched it, though. I'm just aware of it. Well, I guess for what it's worth, he's doing better. Our health is not doing awesome, though. Uh, when the fuck are these people going to get here? Uh, would you like some coffee to start the day? How sweet. Are the are, okay? Did I fuck up and like the bureau doesn't come today? It is the sixth day, and that is today. They come from three until uh, five. So, oh, three till five, one till five. That's right. That's right. Mm. I know today has been a very, very, very boring day so far. At least we closed Cassandra's. That's nice. I was worried that that was going to be testy, if nothing else. Um. Uh, you know what we could do while we're waiting? Let's look at some of the stuff we can buy. Oh, God, please don't tell me that's anybody important. Uh, no, that's just him leaving his house. Okay. Oh, yes, and here he is messaging us. He's like, it's Jeffrey, you know, from the ham bones. Um, so his home fixed, and he appreciates us for it, and he sees it as an improvement. So he is going to send us a little gift, he says. Um, as a fan, as the fan of ham bones that we are, goodbye. So we'll be on the lookout for that. Come on, the council should be here any minute. I've been diligently waiting. Uh, I don't know what's going on with this, uh, this dude who's making stuff in his bathtub. Very flammable, the stuff in his bathtub. I'm pretty sure even not like. I'm probably just remembering it, it's all it is and not guessing, but pretty sure it's like um, a, like an alcohol to run his monster truck. But uh, thank God, are you here for the rent? <laughs> I've been waiting all day. Uh, so nice, ninety bucks to you, cold, heartless reptiles. Uh, temp plumber, no, and oh, Cassandra's no sitting down probably calling the realtor a handyman I could do that or a gardener uh, let's let's do the gardener then handyman then maybe the bottom one I honestly don't know that I care to even see a oh, package we missed it between 10 a.m. and 3 p.m. all right uh, I don't know that I even care to wait for Cassandra's show if it happens to be on yeah I'll be on in a half hour I'm not going to do the temp plumber. Let's just get something in us and get back to the computer. So he's telling his computer goodnight. Speaking of computers, this is still firing on all cylinders. Mm, let's unlock night vision. I don't think I'll see anything new or special. Hmm. Well, we might get to see the Cassandra show after all. Yep, here she is. We could probably see her embarrass. What's his name? Hunter Scott. Well, let's hope that that's the right guy, huh? <laughs> That'd be embarrassing if not. Uh, welcome, my miserable friends. I doubt she sounds nearly that uh, masculine. <laughs> oh, shit. Is that him? Oh, nice. Oh, he's moaning. Dude, honestly, uh, I am glad that she's embarrassing this guy. You should not harass people. He's kind of getting what's coming to him. Uh, I just wish he wouldn't do it. <laughs> Um, oh, today's show is just for you. And then he, <laughs> no, actually, now that I feel, think about it, he totally fucking deserves this. It's not that bad. <laughs> uh, man, uh, unfortunately we'll now get this guy talking to his computer for the rest of the game. So that's kind of lame. Um, so she pretends, I think she's going to pretend from what I'm gathering that, uh, she like came up with his name by divinity. She's like, you know, oh, I came up with your name because I asked the spirits. Um, whoa, she's divining like a demon. Uh, man, she's really playing this up for all it's worth. Uh, I know I still don't need to eat. We got seven food items. 
The spirits curse you. Oh, I hate to hear that, Hunter Scott. Oh, then he's like, what? <laughs> How do you know my name? <laughs> oh, goodness. Wow, we just embarrassed the piss out of him. Nothing's impossible for me. And that's just a taste of what I can do with my gift. Maybe she'll send us like a cool crystal ball. I think if we don't charge her money, then she's, she won't, uh, <laughs> she, she won't do anything for us, but I don't know. I actually have never done this woman's stuff successfully. So, uh, cool. Uh, she just was able to show off her powers and, uh, make a fool out of that guy. Let's get some work in. Oh, I forgot I need to buy more cameras. Shoot. Okay, that's fine. We're still good. Uh, let's get, uh, what? Oh, I can only buy one camera. Oh, and it's a du duo camera. Shit, well, let's hope it's not a very exciting duo camera because I like to do those ones. Let's sleep now for four hours. See what happens tomorrow. I guess worst comes to worst. I could always just rush work, but... Bureaucrats return the day after tomorrow. We're at 10 out of 16 cameras. 99% of the population considers sexism extinct. W. <laughs> uh, oh, it's the uh, author. I'm not good at his. I don't know that I've ever beaten that. Um, nobody else is really doing anything. Oh, okay. Blow blob. We believe in transparency and ethics. Your investment tanked and you're going to see back a single credit. Okay, well, I'm not going to participate in any more investments. Uh, I don't know. I'm not, like, burnt over it. It's just, like, the amount of time you have to wait between them is, like, oh, shit, he said he'd be here at 10, 10 to 3. Who the hell just messaged me? Oh, no, I just got a piece of advice. When fortune calls, be sure to answer. But when the great Cassandra calls, you also better do it. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm going to let that go by, but only because you helped me expose it. Jerk. Uh, he won't be bothering me anymore. Well, I'm glad to, uh, decide to send you a little gift. Oh, shit. Um, cool. I wonder what she's gonna send. I hope it's a cool tarot card. Ah, uh, damn. Shame that, uh, I can't go anywhere, <laughs> uh, and work, because I'd like to go work, get money, open up more of these cams, but, uh, I need to wait on the... Uh, oh, yes. Um, it's kind of lame because we still have to unlock this little camera, but we now have horror here. Oh. So, package for uh, number 11. A bowling ball. That's from our Mr. AI guy. It's a level of wear indicates the use by a professional. And then you can see this card. I'm not sure if I showed it off. I'm pretty sure I did. Um, yes, we'll take fear. I don't think horror and fear gives us anything uh i had mentioned it earlier it's like a, a guy who's writing he's like um a writer uh here you can see the terraformings going very well they have forests uh growing and yeah seven and ten what is oh yeah the alcohol of course um i don't know that that'll get done now i am glad hold on maybe i should just go work real quick Ooh, eight hours as a machine operator well we got our bowling ball so even if we miss the uh yeah we did miss hold up a second delivery tomorrow between 10 and 3 that sounds fun i think i'll just work my little keister off and then uh well i'll work the this is until when 10 oh i need to do this one now um i'll uh work really hard and can i do this one yeah i'll work really hard and uh just stay at home all day tomorrow buy a bunch of cameras that'll give me something good to do while i'm waiting on you know everybody else so now we have night vision uh doesn't look like he changed the book uh yes buy some more cages one wait is tomorrow the rent or is it the day after tomorrow we have a delivery okay we will continue buying cages then. Perfect. I'm interested to see which cages we'll get next. But first, let's eat and go to bed. Uh, snooze for a cool five hours. It'll be nine o'clock then. Man, we got a lot that'll happen tomorrow. We got delivery bot. Uh, we got new cameras. We got a... Oh, well, I guess... Wow, nothing interesting here either. I do like all the uh, futuristic articles, but... Okay, we got a routine observation in 
10. What's the name of the guy in 10? Okay, we can make that happen, I'm sure. So this is another dud. This is... Oh, this is one of the new ones, I think. What is this? ADWR. Oh, okay, Association for the Defense of Waffly Rights. Fight for a butter world. I love it. <laughs> Important notice. No one is available to provide assistance from 10 or 8 until 10 due to association's daily meeting. Daily meeting? Veggie Waffly. The Waffly Shaw. What the hell? Oh, hey, here's our package. Let's see what she sends us. Justice. Hell yes, that looks sick. Major Arcana and Cassandra's Terror. It comes with the calligraphy note that says, Your card indicates that goodness stands out among your many virtues. That's badass. For 90 bucks, dude. That's probably more than she would have gave us. So the Waffrey Shop, an unprecedented success. The popularity of the plant-based alternative to traditional waffles. Oh, known as a veggie waffly. You're crazy for that. I couldn't eat that shit. Um, uh, vegetarians live a much healthier life than I do, but... Ooh, cash register. Cash register? <laughs> uh, should I try and message these guys? Oh, wait, here's this guy. Maybe I can... Wait. Oh, my, look, it's a little girl. Who's at my door? Oh, delivery bot. No, you're at the wrong apartment, boss. Um, well, I got an idea of what this place is, but I couldn't rightly see what we might do here. Uh, <laughs> well, at least she's going to get to try a veggie waffle. Uh, oh, this is uh, a woman with very long and red nails some jewelry um i i'm always kind of interested in shops like these these the kind of people who work them that look like this guy are losers but um i don't know i think that i think that small businesses that are doing stuff like this that are able to actually turn a profit are interesting to me um and that's maybe ignorance but i'm ready to learn okay couldn't do what you people do. Oh, don't get wistful like me, lady. Uh, maybe wafflies are like real things <laughs> in uh, this world. Like real creatures. Uh, There's kind of reminded me a little bit of gremlins. So this here is actually the free uh, DLC. This um, wafflies one. This is part one of the two uh, free DLC. Well, it's not part one of two. It's like one of the two that you can get. Secret Project. Um, I really don't like the writer one, but if I can just find out his name, then I'll be happy. Um, damn. Maybe I should. Between eight and ten, right? Well, I need money for rent tomorrow. I know that. Um, this is really interesting. Let's go to the Wallens. The Wallens are some people from the last game that collected uh, these artifacts and then um, uh, they turned out to be like cursed and well sort of cursed it's like a Chucky doll situation where like they got the doll and they didn't know what it was all about so uh, it ended up killing them so let's do the Wallens diabolical doll yeah, you can see it here. This is the a doll from the first game that ended up killing some people. Funny how uh, things kind of work cyclically like that. Uh, in a big circle, they happen again. Oh, man, this guy puts in a lot of fucking work. <laughs> he sees a lot of customers in a day. Um, should I even concern myself? With oh, an activist. I was trying to win Activist of the Year award. Um, I don't, hmm, between 8 and 10, that's probably where the juicy shit's gonna happen, so let me actually, well, do I have any two-hour shifts I can pull? Yeah, there's a two-hour shift. Not gonna give me quite enough money for, uh, rent for tomorrow, but, okay, so he's done working, which is good with me, and let's just take a little, eh, let's not take a snooze. We're, we're too far into this hour. I feel like I'll miss too much. This is also another interesting camera, too. It's not like blow you away or nothing. Oh, hey, Cassandra's still 
doing her little thing. I don't think I can do anything with her, right? No, Cassandra is done and done. Um, what am I... Oh, he's still a little typing away. Alright, and it did say meetings from... Let's do ADWR. No, right? Waffly writes? Come on, it was ADWR, wasn't it? Yeah, 8 to 10. Oh, it's not even 8, is it? Oh, like actual 8. Right? What is this? Wilders? How can anyone be such a dim wet? What? I've told you a hundred times to use discrete packaging. Uh, oh, is this like a real... Hold up, can't you see that I'm in a delicate position here? All I need is for some flunky to come along and ruin my plan. What is your plan exactly? You got me a little nervous. Um, hmm. Well, a beating is what they should have given you, bean pole. Damn. <laughs> There's no way this guy is that much thicker than this quote-unquote beam pole. We also have to now balance between these two. Um, uh, these two, that's the writer. Uh, I think this is a really interesting character, this woman on the left. I've thought about it a little bit. She never has her eyes open, so she's blind, I would assume. Um, which is an interesting way to represent disability. I don't know, right? Ooh, I need that word really bad, tangled webs. Um, I don't know. I just thought it was interesting. You can call this woman, which I might have to do. It's been a little bit. I think if I just give maybe the name to these people, that'll be enough. Who the hell just messaged me? Oh, my attorney. Uh, unlike your poor uncle. Oh, he fed the monkeys. We can ask him what the Omega specimen is. It's a camera that supposedly unlocks whenever we reach the highest level. Um, the the Omega Primate. But we'll see. And our uncle, I guess, apparently fed the monkeys. Uh, it's a rule that everybody breaks, so he says not to get too tied up in it. What the law doesn't know can hurt you, after all. Alright, I gotta go. Uh, well... That is that. Oh, these two are still talking. Um, Wilders. I'll have to look that up because as far as I'm kind of understanding, it almost looks like he's cutting veggie waffles with real waffles. Um, but you never know, I guess. So, I guess I don't have to flick back over that other one unless I actually see somebody there. And I'm going to... Oh, please come back. Okay. I'm just going to look at these shifts that we had over there available so that I can keep my eye out uh, maybe get rent ready for tomorrow like I said I'm not gonna sell any cool items I don't think but if I had to I would uh, I'm just trying to put it, me in a position where I don't have to mm. what could I even tangled webs producer that'll give me her number I could probably also just search Tangled Webs and see, like, what that is, but I don't think that would really help. Let me see. Nah. It's, it's like, some kind of a sort of sitcom-ish thing, I think. Not, like, sitcom, but, like, a drama that seems lighthearted. Kind of like Zoe 101, maybe, if you understand that. Imbriglious and romantic entanglements of a group of students at Aliosphere. So maybe instead more, like... Shameless? It's probably drum dramatic, right? I also haven't seen Shameless um, before. Uh, Cassandra's doing her show. Yeah, and then I could just like mute old cameras that I don't care for anymore. That would be really nice. Um, okay. Tangled Web's producer. Her name is Mai Kaneko. Uh, we could call her, but I don't know really why we would. Tangled webs. How about Tangled webs draft? No. Nah. Tangled webs secret project? No. I don't think teen drama will help. Producer? Nah. And I don't think my Kaneko does anything. We can call her, but I'm pretty sure that this doesn't help us out at all either. Because we just ask her, like, if you only put up the money, how can you call yourself a visionary? So... Maybe tomorrow they'll talk about a new line of dialogue that'll uh, make things clear for what we should be searching for. But for right now, we are 
Going to go put in some hours, I guess, and as an artisan, an eight-hour shift. Oh, I can only imagine how tough that would be. And I'm going to go ahead and skip forward two hours. Get us a little snooze. I'm sure we're getting tired. All right, 14 out of 16 cameras. Council bureaucrats return today. Yay, terraforming is now supposedly finished. Uh, I thought for some reason that the terraforming ended with this shit on fire, but I must have been wrong. Routine observation of Cage 12. What's the name of the group opposed to the sale of Wafflies? Um, damn, I actually don't know that, so we'll look at that shortly. Let's see the other mail that we had. Cage 13. What's the name of the primate who shows up in Cage 13 every night? Well, I think I actually know this one. Hold up. Cage 13, right? Let me close that. Close that. Oh, Cage 13. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, we can do this one. Uh, we have to wait on this one for another day, actually, first. Because um, we have to wait for the next stage in the graffiti. Now, what else was I wanting to do, if anything? Who the hell's at my door? Oh, shit package for apartment number three well once again I'm not apartment number three uh, oh yes the other thing what is Wilders food company 2063 Johan Baker Wilder waffle manufacturer of sweets iconic products like it's wafflies hmm and uh, Okay, I'm not missing anything, just making sure. Veggie Waffly. Damn it. I don't know that that... Hmm, how about Activism? Or ADWR? Okay, Waffly writes. Hmm. Well, 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 well. I need to figure out the organization that's in direct opposition of... Oh, wait, that's, that's Waffly writes, isn't it? Hold on. Cage 12. Name of the group opposed to the sale of Waffly's. Yeah, that's, that's ADWR. Uh, right, thank you for collaborating. It's being confirmed. It'll be confirmed, confirmed in a couple of hours. Name of the primate in cage 10. Uh, wait, hold up. Name of the primate in cage 10. That's not either of those things. Okay. Well, we got that squared away. Let's... Maybe I should snooze. Oh, yeah, I can't until the council comes and collects the rent. Mm. Well, unfortunately, they don't say anything very important down here. At least we should get paid out uh, from our... Um, uh, we should get paid out from reporting what the name of this organization is. Uh... Yeah, this is the beautiful planet, all terraformed and looking nice. Um, hmm. I guess I could go ahead and eat. A uh, couple bags of meat and a pizza. Yeah, our HP is not doing so hot, but we're doing good on food, at least. <laughs> at least. Uh, damn, I wish the council would show up. Hopefully they show up a little bit quicker than 5 o'clock like they did last time. Uh, look in here, I don't see, well, I could buy one more camera, but I would like to buy the next two together, and I think that's the maximum number of cameras we can get, and ask and you shall receive, um, well, we can buy two more cages, just as I asked, uh, I don't think, maybe if I, well, actually, I don't know that there isn't even anything else to do, because there's no real conflict i don't know what's in the boxes like i said it seems like he's cutting veggie waffles with real waffles oh goodness well at least they should be here to collect the rent in due time god damn it uh maybe i should google some more about um tangled webs yeah but i need the word writer i think yeah that's what i thought uh I'm looking all over the place to see if there's anywhere else that I could do. This is a this is a dud one, of course. This here, I don't have any idea how I'm going to complete. I would guess I have to find them at a very specific time that I haven't seen them yet, which is probably like maybe hella early in the morning. I don't know. Mm. 
damn it, where are those counselors? We're halfway through the available time. Maybe I should just risk it for the biscuit and like wait an hour. Um, maybe. Let's check our little alarm. Yes, we missed them. You're shitting me, dude. Whatever. I cannot believe I slept for an hour and fucking missed the dudes coming to get the rent. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's what I mean. This is so annoying. I wish it would just wake you up. Alright, so photographer, let's do night dormin. And then maybe I'll do some sleeping. Or I could go get some energy drinks too. Hmm, let me think. Let's get club evaluation. Let's, yeah, let's get a uh, bunch of energy drinks, a bunch of fruit jello to get our HP back up. And mm, that's good. Yep, we got plenty of energy drinks. We, we shouldn't have a reason to even need to sleep now. And did I buy all the... Yep, I bought all the cameras. Yes, let's turn on the night vision for to grab Sprouted Out Loud. That's one of the things we need. So if we search Sprouted Out Loud, it returns a Prima Belladonna store. Prima Belladonna is ran by Robin Monroy. And Robin Monroy is the person... Or Monroy, I guess. I don't know why I say it like that, but... Um, we can go to Cage 13. They show up every night, this Robin Monroy. Cool. And we'll get paid out on that, right? Hold up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, Cage 10. The person's name in Cage 10 is... Oh, you know something else? We missed uh, this guy tonight, but that's more or less fine. All right, let's get some of our new food in us. How about it? Uh, got our energy up and getting our HP up quite a bit in our food. Hmm. And we do got the money for the rent, so that's nice. I don't think there's anything else that I really need to do. Might go ahead and progress the time forward two hours so that we can get the next day started. When is the next club thing? Oh shit, tomorrow's the club evaluation. Crazy. Uh, that, uh, Stomp 12, large golf course. Yeah, another uninteresting. Cage 13 has changed to closed. Very nice. And they paid out our 90 bucks. Uh, this one's a dud. This one, I don't see a way I could complete in one day. Nah, there's no way. Uh, I, I guess just, I'm happy to pay the rent. When did they say they're going to come? Usual hours? One to... Yeah, one to five. Eh, fuck it. Let's go ahead and sleep till... Wait a minute. Three... No, 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 no. Let's sleep until right before one o'clock. I just don't want to be waiting in my apartment all day. Um, all right. This is a shame because this one's kind of fun, but again, I don't think I can knock it out in a day, and I'm not going to break my back trying to make that happen and break my back like it's that hard oh uh, hey here's the guy again um he is our fourth m is modus operandi arandi um informants working for the evil forces oh it's worth investigating he says and somehow we're back here at the middle i really don't feel like i did anything that evil but whatever maybe being a bo boring person is evil Mm. And I they still haven't came to collect the rent just yet. I don't think I don't think there's anything else that Oh, please be here for the rent. Yeah, and then they have muscle here now. <laughs> oh, of course I have your rent. There you go. Please take it. Uh club evaluation tomorrow. Ha ha ha, right? Okay. Well, well, well. Let's do, uh, hmm, let's maybe go work. How much food do I got in the fridge? I forgot how many days there are, but I think tomorrow might literally be the last day. This game, like, wants you to play, like, a bunch of times, and I don't want to go do all the cameras, and all the endings are, like, lame, because, like I said, you can just get one ending from, like, uninstalling. Normally, I do all the endings in this game, but I think this is a fair representation of this game. I guess if people desperately wanted me to, like, you know, continue doing this for some reason, I might. Um, let's do... 
well, hold up. Let's just go work some. And then if it ends tomorrow, because I won't be able to resolve any of those uh, in that like short amount of time. Um, let's see. She's messing around. Cassandra's doing her stuff. Man, how weird this would be if this actually existed. I, although I suppose this is kind of just like literally what being in the NSA is kind of like, right? <laughs> you just spy on people through, uh, like the vulnerabilities in their, uh, hardware. Mm. I still, mm. well, let's just see what happens tomorrow, I guess. At least we got the rent paid up, and we do have a lot of money now. We have 16 out of 25 cameras. All right, cool, so we can do even more cameras. All right, let's get into it tomorrow. All right, terribly sorry about that. I'm back. Um, I thought that was the end, and I was just trying to like kind of rush to get to the end, but it turns out I was mistaken. We have another five days, so we still have to pay the, pay the council bureaucrats uh, rent in a couple of days. Uh, none of these are anything we have to worry about. Now we can do these, uh, right, the, may the way that they're meant to be. Oh, yes, we just hit level three, of course. Uh, yes. Now, let's see. I already did 13, right? 13's closed. 12 is the waffle thing. I have no idea how to do. 10 is going to be the rider, which I think is going to at least take a day or two. And this one is not too hard. I just need to get the right words. I don't think last night I could have done very much anyway because um uh uh he was she was talking to her boss and there's not a lot of uh you know words that we can use there. So another thing, you'll notice that this name down here, this is like a spoofing machine so she can make calls and spoof the name and number. Um so it'll be different every day. So if you want to make a call you have to re re ting it. Now I, I really I don't actually think there's a good reason to call this woman, so I probably won't. Uh, it's just a little storytelling device. Um, now, is there... I guess I do kind of need her to talk about, like, stars and shit. Constellation. Yeah, that should be on the right side now. And I also still need to buy um, a few more um, cameras as well. We need... Oh, hot dog. That's quite a few cameras. All right. Well, we'll probably work some jobs and stuff. I don't have to pay rent today. So, uh, club evaluation was today. Pay rent tomorrow. Mm, let's make this a little small. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what I can do about that exactly. This waffle place. Cause it seems like during the day he's just going to do waffle shit. Uh, like sell stuff. And then at night he's going to, uh, talk with that guy. This guy is kind of weird. He's a security and animal control officer for the quote-unquote local zoo. So I don't know if he works for, like, some government entity or for the monkeys, um, you know. But uh, he asks if we've come into contact with any of our strange neighbors. I'm just going to say I haven't had contact with any of my neighbors. All right, good. Uh, and we got a little morality boost there. Working in a clandestine. I don't think that's going to help us out very much. I need the name of a couple of stars first. I think that's what they are. Stars or moons. Um, what is she going to do now? Um, this guy's still yapping with customers. Again, as I was saying, I don't know how we're going to do him. I w if I had to guess this one, I actually won't get done. So how many does that put us at not getting done exactly? The waffle shop. This guy, I'm just not sure. We're going to have to see. And this one here. Damn, that's way too many not done, actually. Um, this guy's still going to just be typing up his thing. We got anything we can do for like four or five hours. There's a four-hour four, four hour job as a rainmaker. This ought to be interesting. I wonder how you make rain. Well, here in the future, it's probably not um, too, uh, too difficult. If they can terraform whole ass planets oh yes perfect we hit this just in time because it's this lady's sister so we can grab a bunch of words that we need from here i think um so she's complaining that her sister calls from a new number every time and this lady here has lied and said that the reason for that being um uh sorry the reason for that being 
that her little telephone caller is busted. Of course, she does this on purpose, so she can't be traced. Um, and nowhere else to really grab right now. Uh, well, right? Ooh, here's the shady guy. I guess I'll flip between these two and see if there's any, um, anything I can, uh, grab from their conversation. Uh, I also sort of forget. I think we need the word student from here, uh, from the robot girl. Legends, that'll help a little bit. I don't think very much, but it'll get the, the planet one. Uh, oh, no, not this one. It'll get this planet star constellation thing sorted out. Uh, maybe there isn't more to do here. Uh, well, I suppose probably exposing them. Maybe I should just record it. Oh, it's incompatible with that one. So, thank God we got student. I almost missed that one. <laughs> uh, well, I we might be able to get a bunch of... Um, a, like, get maybe even finish this one here. I'm just going to see how close it is to being done. Like, this conversation that these two sisters are having. All right, she says she has to get going. I don't want to miss the one word that'll, you know, win that one. Yeah, I guess I can't record that um, tank, which I suppose makes sense, sort of. Uh, what is this camera? Oh, they're just chatting. Damn. I need to get writer, because um, I need to find Tangle Web's writer. Tangle Web's writer. Maybe should I even stress that much about this one maybe not we eat a whole ass pizza and drink an energy drink <laughs> uh our health's doing pretty bad but if we only have like five more days that's not i mean we've burned through what like 12 days already uh and also if you let your sleep or hunger get too low then um you'll lose hp too i really just maybe i'm missing the beginning of their conversation or something let's just do this one constellation legend Perfect. So we get three planets, and inside of those planets, actually, where the hell? Oh, Lacida constellation. This will give us. Those are constellation. These will give us. Uh, hold up, constellation. Martian constellation. These will give us planet names, and finally the Lucy constellation. Perfect. Now we also search for accident in relation to these planets, because it turns out one of the, these systems sisters was the victim of a accident on one of these planets uh um what is what was that who, who 12 um and i think the one hold up constellation yeah this happened in who 12 so it's a diamond we'll need uh julia tejeda student perfect she's a member of the ucm students association so now we can message her and tell her that her sister is uh, you, you know you get this messaging with her uh, in MS uh, m instant messaging we can ask her if she knows a hideaway uh, and she's like uh, of course we know about the hideaway it's one of our famous stories uh, stories um, there's a fraternity that's selling uh, I guess alcohol or secret stuff to other students and the reason that they aren't getting re oh no this is uh, students who embed secret messages into uh, old recordings and it's been part of the curriculum very funny reminds me of the old like uh, things where they're like if you play a Beatles song bas backwards it says praise the devil <laughs> man how goofy people were uh, I need to ask is that the girl who went missing um, she's like says that she's done other things since then uh, what happened the day you disappeared? I don't think any of these are actually really important. She just says that she was walking around and then she's trapped in a canyon. Um, parents must have been worried. Uh, I guess they stayed behind on the birth planet. They got sick and then died. And so these sisters haven't seen their parents since then. Sister, can I ask about your sister, please? <laughs> uh, happened on a Who brand planet, right? Hmm. Cool. Compensated them both with a year's worth of free candy. Uh, and it, the one sister eats it in three months. How crazy. I guess if it's that good. Okay. 
Sister, I thought we needed. Uh, do I got, yeah, I got a little bit of time to think about it. Where did sister even pop to? Down here. Right, student, sister, accident, ravine. Um, I want to talk about a criminal, you know. Um, so, oh yeah, this is the thing I was talking about. So I guess there's somebody who sells, uh, <laughs> sells alcohol at the university, but they turn the other cheek or turn the, a blind eye to it because the dean's one of the best customers. That's funny. Uh, anyway, uh, we tell her, no, your sister is a, um, is a criminal, not, uh, uh, not whoever you're talking about. All right. So some stars protect you. And she's like, what? How do you know that? We don't tell anybody that. Well, wait, you have to prove to me first that you know the form of the stars. And it's, of course, a diamond. And she's like, how's that possible? <laughs> uh, it's kind of interesting that their family believes that a constellation looks out for them. I suppose it's not so far as what, uh, you know, people who looked up at real life, con well, yeah, real life constellations years ago thought, or I think ancient Indian traditions also believe that uh, some constellations watched over them like bears and stuff. But anyway, she's going to have a talk with her sister. I'm getting away from the point a little bit. Cage 15 has been changed to pending, so I don't have to mess with that anymore. Um, how about, hmm, I don't think, let's just say I did Tangled Webs. Okay, Tangled Webs producer? Hmm. How about a producer? How about teen? No. Tangled Webs teen drama? That ain't gonna happen. Okay, let's go get some work in. Uh, four hour shift. Two four hour shifts? Sure, let's do it. I got energy drinks back at the house. Uh, this will let me buy some cameras, and I do want to keep enough money in the pocket for rent, of course. See how much money we end up with. Alright, I can probably buy like at least four cameras. One, two, three, and then this is the part that gets kind of unwieldy. Oh, I can't buy four cameras. That's too much? Yeah, 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 that's too much. Um, shit. But I should buy 18.1 if I can. Eh, it's not that big a deal. Let's drink one energy drink and then sleep two hours until it's time to start the next day. I'm interested to see which new cameras we're going to unlock. We need six more by four days from now. Uh, a murderer's on the loose. Mathematician solved the Didymus equation. Workers furious at lack of jobs. Nah, nothing important. So, oh, this is a really fun one. Oh, and we got the shitty camera, too. <laughs> Shoot. Um, so we'll get the grave and the luminescent flower. Uh, named after the... Or was developed by the late scientist Hannah Black. So then we can search for Hannah Black, and there she is. Very pretty. How about Hannah Black grave? Eh, no such luck. Okay. Um, these two are just waking up. That's the most useless of all the words you can get, I think. This one's kind of hard to get working right for you if you don't know exactly what to do. Uh, so these two are married, and I guess that's really all you would think about them if you didn't know there was more to this quest, and I guess if you didn't buy their second camera, if you were a psychopath and didn't for some reason. Uh, what else is going on in the everywhere else? Nothing important, I hope. Oh, I cannot buy that cage just yet. Probably gonna work. Uh, yeah. We'll, ho we'll s hopefully they get here like right when they're supposed to collect the rent. You know how well that's been going so far though. Um, I just think some of these cameras are funner than the other ones and I don't know. They all kind of have a twist that I think is interesting but uh, this one here is probably my favorite out of all of them. They did really good riding this one. Uh, and I don't need camera 15 since that one's closed from now on. Alright, which I got 17, but I can't do anything with that until nighttime. Um, can I actually, there's no way I can like, yeah I was about to say there's no one hour shift, so I know that for sure. There's a two hour shift. Mm, should I, nah, hold up. Let me think for two seconds. Maybe I should work. Oh, this one's blinking red now. <laughs> Something tough is going on there. You know what? Fuck it. 
I'm gonna go I'm gonna go work for eight hours. I'm gonna miss that. No, I just don't want to sleep through tomorrow when they'll come and collect the rent again. Uh yeah. I'll be here between one and five, as usual. Work another eight hours. We should be good off that. Mm. Might have to call and order some food. I see we're getting pretty hungry. Uh you're not a good fit and we have to tell you to go. Well, at least I got paid. Mm. And I probably need a little bit more money. Yeah, because all my... Everything's kind of coming up due. We got to eat. We got to pay rent. Oh, yes, I love this tree guy. Um, He looks cool, if nothing else. So we'll buy this other camera. And then what are we going to do? Well, I'm hungry. So let's drink a few energy drinks. Okay, energy's all the way up. And let's order, hmm, let's order like four pizzas. And then, let's see, what next? Let's buy two cameras, two more cameras. All right, so I'm sorry, you'll notice that the time is a little bit cut uh, in a weird way because um, my power went out about five minutes after the last bit of the recording. And uh, this is what I was able to salvage. Now, it isn't too bad because I did. I was able to save uh, day 12's progress, but uh, or day 11's progress. So I didn't lose the whole uh, day. I guess I just wanted to catch you guys up. I should have uh, the pizza coming. Like I said, today's the exact same day as the day before. I just, you know, did a little. I did things a little bit more efficiently. Uh, and now I got my pizzas. I am going to, I think, eat and snooze. Yeah, a little two-hour snooze. And we can't forget today. Absolutely important. We do have to pay rent to get back on topic. Uh, well, get back to the game. This is like the let's play that feels like it never ends. I'm now on like day four of recording of this. So, <laughs> not that I'm complaining. but So, we got mailed a discount code for Mystery Stew and Pizzas. I don't think this is something I can interact with, actually. Well, oh, no, 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 that's for 18, which is right here. Uh, this one will actually be, I think this one's really fun. Uh, and you can get a little bit confused on what you're supposed to do uh, if you don't keep your head on a swivel. I'm going to go ahead and sleep another two hours. It doesn't look like anybody's really doing much of anything right now, so we'll sleep while nothing's happening. All right, everything's going chill here, and then we'll have those people for our rent in about an hour to five. Um, excuse me. Uh, I like all the signs and stuff. There's a lot of callbacks to other games, and I was hoping to show some of them um, because it's a couple games I've covered, and if it's not a games that I've covered, it's games that I want to cover. Is there something I'm missing here? I did... A already uh do the mail for 12 didn't i and again just looking quickly make sure i don't miss anything else uh or not mail but what they'd asked me yeah so what whatever i guess and then i think i fucked up 13 no 13 i just don't have an answer for yet observation in cage 15 on uh, what is cage 15 oh yeah i'm not doing that one. Oh yes that girl's sister is messaging us again um, and she says, I know it's been a while since I wrote you back, but I've been busy. My sister it turns out to have been a criminal, but we're working on it. Uh, they're going to leave that life behind so that they can live a better life together. So that's pretty sweet. Um, and, uh, anyway, the, they love each other. So that's, uh, very sweet. And, uh, they're going to send us a little gift. And since, uh, You'll see here very soon that it's not money. You can guess that we're going to get another item. So kind of cool. We've got a bunch of items over here and stuff now. Uh, what else? Yeah, where all do I have to keep an eye on? I have to keep an eye on 10.2 and 18, at least during the day. At night, I'll have to keep an eye on maybe 17. I'm not sure. Uh, eight's not important. Actually, let me go through these real quick. One's dead, two dead, three four, five, six, uh, seven's alive. So six through one is dead. Eight is finished. Nine is finished. Seven and ten are both uh, still going. 
12 seems to still be going, but I don't know. Let's see. Waffrey Shop and Wilders. Whoa, first serious competition. Okay, so competition between the two. That's interesting. Um, what is... I hope it's just that 12 popping. Yeah, you can see here's this bird, now that that guy visited the other day, who's going to pop up and make some annoying-ass noises while we work. Uh, let's see. Veggie Waffle competition waffery shop i don't know are you here for the rent oh yeah i always love that they bring this big fucking lizard guy every time that we're late on the rent it's just funny to me <laughs> i could work now i guess if i felt like it but i don't think i'm going to i'm waiting on 18 to do their thing i think i called it 10 earlier definitely not 10 was there something asking about a 10 earlier that i mistook for no 18 i thought there was now who the hell is this Ooh, a new package for us. Probably that those sisters mailed us. Man, same day shipping. Crazy. And it says, thank you for helping me guide my sister to the right path. And it's got their little diamond on it. Now, isn't that sweet? It sells for 70 bucks. Um, I'm still waiting. Ten, or 18 is not active quite yet. Um, and I guess it probably won't be till night. Is there anything else? Maybe I could do some more searching. ADWR competition? No. Waffrey shop. I still, I don't know. I think this one's going to be those that ends up as a dud. If I finish it, I would be really surprised. Because um, I don't really know what the point of this is. Um, like, I'm not sure. Well, well, maybe I could like, oh yeah, well we can't record. Duh. I forgot. Again, you'll have to forgive me. This is now taking place over three or four days of recording. I was like, oh, of course, I can record it and then send it in. Speaking of recording, this doesn't do anything for us, right? Yeah, there's nothing here. It's just some guy who's uh, <laughs> uh, cooking in his bathtub. Well, cooking to say that he's making something. They call it, uh, in the words of Breaking Bad, cooking crystal meth. So, uh, cooking up some uh, fuel or alcohol, rather, maybe. Uh, let's drink a couple little energy drinks. Let's do two of them. And, oh, we got another ding. Is somebody doing something interesting? No, of course not. No, but nothing ever happens. It's just, what is this, Cassandra or whatever doing her thing? Aber Cassandra, that's right. Uh, we got four more cameras to unlock. Maybe I should go work tonight and get those cameras unlocked i don't know why 18 hasn't popped off yet today oh okay well speak of the devil watch this is i think this is like my favorite of all the cameras in this game it's uh really not <laughs> i keep hyping it up it's really not like the crazy shit you ever see so here's this lady right and she's got like a secret lab in her home or under it and then you can see all these faces popping up they're getting ready to have a meeting make sure i'm not missing anything i'm not um so every day they have a little discussion with one another and this is like a druid this well, i don't know what that is it's like a little doll i think uh again this is the druid lady they, they've got like all these different uh people that are in this organization called the cooperative of evil and i think i'm gonna wait just a little longer to record since they're talking about the plan today. Um, if we villains don't look out for each other, so of course they're villains. We're looking for a couple very specific words. Um, so, they should hopefully actually actually start talking about the plan soon enough. Uh, instead of just bickering at each other's starts. It is sweet. This guy's a robot. He, he's cool. Uh, th the... <laughs> <laughs> they all like kiss ass each other, which is funny for villains. Well, kiss ass is a little bit of a strong word, but and then this is like an alien lady. Uh, but they're all like, "Oh, of course you're awesome. You have worth and stuff." And then what they want to do is like evil shit. So, <laughs> oh well, I suppose in good and evil, good and evil are a little bit subjective, a little bit. Some people will tell you that there's no morality in the world, but there's a universal type. Type, I think. Okay, blackout. That's. I think we're getting towards um, what we're hunting for, at least. Oh, these two are talking. Of course, I've been missing that. This here, I also think I'm going to have to take a buy on because I have no... I need the word writer, 
and I have no fucking clue how I'm going to get it. Um, this is a game that you're kind of meant to play several times because, eh, with the, well, with the DLCs and all, I am probably missing over half of the cameras in this game. Um, I'm just flipping back and forth to make sure that I don't miss any yellow. Oh, yes, let's go ahead and, uh, record this. Of course, I don't want to miss that at all. Uh, they're talking about their plan. This isn't the best shot, but that should still pass. Okay, movies. All right, all right. Um, I'm, I'm, I don't think that'll be enough, but we'll have to see. Um, I think these guys are all done, so we can start doing some research. Yeah, it's cool, because they're like a fucking whole-ass league of villains, uh, that this woman's, like, pretending to have a normal life. She's like, yeah, I just stay at home, and I'm bored, and I miss you while you're at work. And she's, like, a little bit embittered to her husband, probably because she doesn't feel like there's much going on in her life. Uh, but she's like, yeah, I'm just you know, bored here without you all day. And then during the day, she's like, good evening, my super evil friends. <laughs> and again, it's just funny, stupid. Uh, no, I don't have to look at 10 for a little bit. Uh, I actually think these two here are just going to rehash what I've already seen so far. So let's say horror movies. No, let's say the Wallens movies. No. Tango Webb's movies? Nope. Teen drama movies? I didn't think so. I don't think we're gonna... I don't think it's gonna happen. Shoot. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and do this one, though. Alright. So, um... Villains. Let's search for villains. So they got vigilantes who tend to stop villains. This is a funny little article because he's like, uh, this is like a Wikipedia. And he's like, hey, man, did you just post a picture of our boss who's here on the right? <laughs> and he's like, don't you know people get fired for less? Uh, now then, how about vil villains? Vigilante. Nope, that's not it. Um, how about just vigilante? No. Vigilante computer virus? cooperative of evil come on i'm surely not missing how about blackout computer virus hmm computer virus damn it i can't believe i'm missing oh shit hey here's this guy uh I could record no i can't record him okay um anyway we can grab some of this guy's words oh he's got a cool suit too i actually think that's enough to uh to close this cage out. Let me search for the seamstress. The seamstress sleeveless suit. No, that's not enough. Uh, I don't understand. Oh, he's gone. Interesting. That must have been the end for him. Ah, uh, the seamstress. Uh, luminescent flower. I don't know how these two are tied up together. All right. What else was I going to do, if anything, tonight? Maybe just go to work. Wait for tomorrow. Um... That one's not happening. This one I could probably do. Wait, who's up? Uh, not seeing anything. Okay. Yes, let's go to work. We still have to pay rent and stuff, unfortunately. I could sell these items if I wanted to, but I think it's cooler to collect them. Uh, I can tell you, you had your eyes wide open. Okay, so we got paid for that at least. Uh, work this? I wouldn't see why I wouldn't. Oh, uh, well, I could have bought some cameras, but that's fine. How many more days? We got Council of Bureaucrats returns tomorrow, and the next evaluation is in two days. Oh, UCM grant to Julia Tejeda for her outstanding outstanding social contribution. Wow, that's sweet. Uh, so they're seeing success, those sisters are. Let's, uh, which way to do this? Am I going to miss anything during the day? No. So let's go ahead and buy a couple cameras and go to work. Uh, is there anywhere that's doing work this early? Hold up. That one happens at noon. Noon. Shoot. So can't do nothing till noon. Is there... Maybe I should do a little more searching. Because you can't search for cooperative of evil. Pretty sure you can't do villains. Vigilante and I need a different word. Um... Because they're like real life superheroes in this universe. Uh, how about Blackout? Eh, am I missing something? Uh, don't think so. These are just all the things that are active right now. You, uh, To my knowledge, you'll never need uh, 
any of these words. Who the fuck's at the door? Uh, no, it's not apartment number three. Sorry, bud. <laughs> it is funny because they say that these robots have, like, robot dyslexia. That's, like, the in-universe reason that... Because before, in the last game, it was just some old guy who couldn't read because his eyesight was so bad. It's a, it's a shame that there aren't permanent jobs in this game like there was in that one, but whatever. Uh, I felt like that gave the last game a lot of charm. Like, if you save this plumber in an elevator, then you could be a plumber. And if you, like, uh, are nice to the... Oh man, my heart's dropping a lot. Um, if you're nice to the mailman and don't try to steal packages from him, um, then, uh, oh god, it's this guy. Okay, what does he want now? Oh, we're doing the fifth M, which is what? Motive. The dark forces are just plain evil, nah. They make sure, to, they watch to make sure everything stays the way they like it. I think they're trying to make sure no one discovers them. Uh, let's do this one. That sounds more conspiracy theory-ish. Um, that makes sense. Okay. Well, you have to look at your gizmo graph to see. You achieved a higher level of independent thinking than I expected. Cool. So, is that really what you think that is, is independent thinking? I would kind of like to do a more evil playthrough of this game. Certainly the first game, maybe. I don't know. You can't even really be too, too evil or anything, but... Let's get this six-hour shift going. Um, and then we'll do the next one. I'm thinking if I work tonight... Hold up. What's all the dinging going on? All oh, these guys are talking. Okay. So this is the very beginning of this meeting. I happen to know. So let's watch this one. I'm going to ding that one. Am I missing anybody else? No. Uh, end of the world. And let's go to... to, to, to this guy so i can keep an eye on his stuff uh okay perfect shoo uh so we haven't missed anything to my knowledge and nice we perfect just like i figured they're having their meeting at the same time that these two the writer is having their meeting i'd like to finish theirs um but i don't know at this rate uh so uh, i do think we got the uh the word that I needed, which was end of the world. See, they'll split these, like, into two. So, like, they might have, like, a morning and an evening one, right? But then they also might have, like, a alternate evening one, which happens every other evening meeting, if that makes sense. Um, I don't know. I like Leagues of Villains. The fucking Sinister Six from the Marvel shit was so awesome. Uh, anytime that, like, the bad guys teamed up and stuff, uh... In like movies or TV shows, that shit was awesome. I, I'm having a hard time thinking of something specifically, specifically. Oh, you know, Teen Titans, that was cool whenever there was that evil league. Um, year 2100 bug. Uh, would you rather I sucked up to you? I don't really think... Yeah, I don't think... Well, not that I was sure that recording would really do me much good there, but... and. I must not be searching the right thing um, to do the alcohol one. I must not be. So uh, I'm pretty sure that we're close to finishing this one at least, which is fine because it's one of my favorites. Um, oh, there's people talking on forums about this show. Say it isn't so and say that they're not negative. <laughs> uh, okay. I don't, I don't know about this one. Uh, I would like, I, I don't know what's going on with the, the bathtub one. I think that one might be a dud. Man, does that mean that I had more, nah, I've completed more than I've had duds in this one at least. So, that's a point in my corner. Now, of course, four points against me seems to be all these ones that I'm not gonna finish. If it's even four at this point, eh, nah, we're, we're, we're gonna finish 18, so. Um... Abra Cassandra's doing her thing. Okay, well, I finished six, and I'm going to finish a seventh one. Um, hold up. Let's do this one here. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, vigilante end of the world. Aha, Jonathan Criswell. You can see this article 17 years ago. He's gonna. He promises to rehabilitate all villains. But if we look at Jonathan Criswell... Um, a hero bids us farewell after fulfilling his mission. Five years ago, he rehabilitated all the villains and had to retire um now we have to do 
Villains. Wait. No, 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 no. Jonathan Criswell Vigilante. Nah, he's got basically like a, um, he's got like a little article about him on the internet that has his contact, uh, contact information. No, I'm not cooperative of evil villains. Here we go. So that's how we'll get in touch with him. Hero for hire at a good price. So he's still putting in personals ads. Okay. Jonathan Criswell and computer virus, which is, you can see here, the pieces are all coming together. Seven years ago, he stopped this lady who looks familiar, uh, from doing the same plan that she's doing right now. So let's message Jonathan. Uh, he's not online right now. What time is it? Midnight. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, let's go work if I can. Two hour shift, uh, two, two hour shifts or what just dinged over here? Nothing important. All right, let's get our two, two hour shifts in. Then I, I can buy a camera. I think I can afford to buy a camera. Um, Okay, what's that put us at? Yes, I could buy one camera. How am I doing on hunger? Let's eat, drink. Yeah, my HP is getting down to critical levels, but that's that's okay. Uh, let's at least buy this camera. Yeah, so we're only down. We just need one more. Uh, Jonathan, are you awake? No. Uh, maybe I should just sleep for four hours. Let me get the camera up and get it all set up to the way I would like it. Uh, what... I really don't care to look at any of these, honestly. Maybe before I call this one, like, cooked, maybe I should, like, search the Wallens a little bit. The Wallens, uh, draft, no, fear, draft, no, okay. I think I'm cooked on this one. I don't, I don't know about that one. Let's sleep for four hours. I need to make triple double sure whenever I wake up that I do have the rent, which is not a beyond me to just completely forget to do the rent. Uh, correction, using post the highest profits of the quarter. Nah, nothing important here. Uh, I have no idea what cage 20 is. What is cage 17? The name of the establishment where cage 17. Oh, okay. Uh, I might be able to do that. Hold up. I have the answer at least. Name of the establishment where the primate in 17 acquired his clothing. Well, I would have to have more words, I think, because the seamstress, yeah, I can't just search for a sleeveless suit, right? Oh, okay, apocalyptic fashion. And the seamstress, damn it. Apocalyptic fashion, sleeveless suit, no. The seamstress, damn it. I'm missing like one word and it's such a pain in the ass. Uh, oh, you know who, who I could probably talk to today? To get it done and over with. Whoa, not this. Don't pull that up. I want to talk to Jonathan Criswell. Oh my god, he's never online. Um, this here, I have no idea what this is. The chalk outline. The time. Uh, I don't know what's going on there exactly. This room. Maybe they'll do something in it later. I think this is one of the DLC cages that I bought, actually. That's probably why I don't recognize it. Um... And is there anything else? No, we gotta pay rent today. We can't can't goof around too much. Oh here you here's this guy. Is he he gonna do anything special that you know we might be able to uh hear him talk about or uh so we can close his cage? Okay. I surely have to be searching something. Boogie woogie monster truck. No. Boogie woogie jar fest. Alright, jar fest monster truck. Um, the truck will be scrapped immediately after the event as it does not comply with the safety regulations. Well, at least this camera doesn't shut down just because you don't do it in a couple of days. Uh, yeah, our HP is still really low. I wish they would come just collect the rent so I could go goof around. Oh, come on, Clarence, you can do it. Okay, so he must be trying to solve this fucking, uh, uh, case. They wouldn't have given it to you if you weren't ready. All right, all right. Believe in yourself, Clarence. Let's let's try and deduce what happened. Go over everything you know, like in the detective course. Out loud, of course. Say it out loud to yourself. Took place the night of Thurs... Um, no. <laughs> oh, God, you're so nervous. You're, you're hurting yourself, dude. <laughs> What's she going to do, die a second time? That's what I'm saying. And look at her. She was ugly. Well... Yeah, she was ugly. 
<laughs> I was like, do I want to be rude? And then I was like, well, you know, sometimes it's just facts. Um, so the testimony of someone, yes, yeah, someone definitely said that. He sounds like me trying to improv <laughs> a, a little bit, not like a, not like comedy, but like in a let's play. Like, um, I know somebody said it, uh, she staggered before falling on the clock. Um, next morning her servant went in to clean and reported the homicide. Yeah. She was the only one with a set of keys. God, this is some, like, the butler did it bullshit, isn't it? Uh, okay. Not to mention that hers were the only fingerprints found in the room. Probably the cleaner they met. Besides the victims. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I thought. Um. Something doesn't fit there. Okay. I am not sure. So, 215, we can tell because the clocks broke. Right, one fifteen because the clock's broke. Let's let's see if we get anything from these homicide. Wait, what's this? Rational creatures, home. It seems like it doesn't include you. I don't think you've understood the definition. Come and I'll explain it to you with a demonstration. What the fuck? Saturday. Okay, crime scene. What about like homicide Saturday? Uh, I was hoping that would return like, oh fingerprints. What the? Hell? I was hoping it would return like um. Uh, oh, then he's just hanging out in this room. What a fucking creep. <laughs> oh, okay. He's flipping through notes. I saw there for a second. I was like, he's just sitting there, like, m m they call it malingering? That ain't the word. He's sitting there just doing nothing. There's his notes again. Oh, yes, let's fucking message the, the one guy. I keep forgetting about this. Uh, Jonathan Criswell. Thank God. He's like, Jonathan Criswell, low budget hero, or budget price hero, how can I help you? Uh, I'd like you to stop Madison Sharp. And then he's like, well, she's reformed, so, you know, uh, you're, you're seven years too late. Go ahead and pay me. <laughs> uh, now, because we recorded her, though, um, uh, we can send it to him and he'll believe us. Otherwise, he won't. So, uh... He's like, yeah, I'm tired of hearing you badmouth people I've helped. <laughs> Here's your proof, buddy. Uh, it's a it's a MP4 file uh, of of your uh, uh, former arch nemesis or whatever. Uh, oh shit! It got Koa Lowo, the crazy Kawiki, and Nocturnal Muse. Crazy. So he's gonna have to stop all these villains. All right. Unfortunately, that is this one closed. Uh, you don't get to see him like break in or anything cool. Um, I don't think. I bet I could call him because I bet that's a receiver right there. I would have to get his name and stuff. Can I just search for the time? No. Where the fuck are these guys for my rent, dude? Uh, is there anything else I can do? I definitely want to complete substantially more quests than I don't. Uh, I could probably do this one if I just stayed awake tonight. Uh, man, we are really not doing great on HP, are we? And I'm completely out of food. And there's so many things dinging. Um, running out of stock. Okay. Hey, ladies, here for the rent. There you go. Alright. So, yeah, no more rent payments. Just the club evaluation tomorrow. Which, of course, we do need 50 bucks for to finish. We cannot forget that. Um, what? No, nothing's happening here, I don't think. Uh, no. These four. Yeah, nothing important. All right, let's go get some work in. Uh, need 50 bucks. Okay, photographer and employee for employee shots. Well, I hope this doesn't hurt me to the point it kills me. Yikes, it did take a bunch of RHP. Holy shit. Okay, let's uh, let's go get some fruit jello. Oh god, I hear I hear the heartbeat sound. Are we are we really about to die? <laughs> I'm not even that hungry. Okay, there we go. That'll turn things around for us. Give us a little bit of HP. Make sure we get through it. Give us enough food too. And we'll buy the last camera that we need. Okay, anything else that I could possibly be missing here that I can solve just real quick? I don't, don't think so. Let's sleep 
one hour at a time to make sure that I don't miss the... Oh, uh, that's probably him right there. Uh, don't miss the guy at the grave. Let's, let's see if he's there. No. Actually, these two are back in bed. I don't even think we'll get to read the article about those two being stopped, but... Uh, or we won't get mailed. Uh, actually, I think he gives us money. So yeah, we aren't even missing out on an item or anything. The guy who's going to stop that supervillain crew. I think... I think really that's just about the best that uh, we can do. Let's sleep four hours. Because I want to see this last uh, hour make sure that... You know, like I've said a billion times, I'm not really missing anything. Um, nope. Looks good to me. I, this rider one is just so... It's it's pretty difficult. I haven't even seen an opportunity to interact with this alcohol shit. Um, I can't click on anything else in this room. So, uh, yeah. Just making triple double sure. I'm not m just missing one little thing. Uh, I do kind of wish, like, you could buy an upgrade. I wish there were more upgrades for one. Uh, but I wish you could buy an upgrade that would show you all the interactables or, like... You could record for longer, so you could review footage and stuff. Maybe in the next game. Maybe in the next game. So today is the club evaluation, right? Yes, we've got... We passed the last evaluation. Oh, and they're asking us for something about Cage 20, but we have to interact with the monkey first. All right, so we open the door. A uh, little bird told me you're waiting for instructions to collect your reward. Come with me. Okay, so anti-particle... Who only know how to be contrary. You know that you'll never be able to forget your time in the club. A fortuitous encounter with an old Marnabor shows you the time. What the fuck does any of that even mean? Okay. Keep the horrors you went through on level 4 from flooding your mind. What the fuck? This is like a room full of gears. Um, Put you at peace with yourself. Oh, so basically, this ending blows. It's like, uh, wow. This is a really shitty ending. So so basically, you're just happy being a cog in the machine. Uh, is that supposed to be the good ending? Like, if you have high morality, uh, you, like, understand that the monkeys exist, but, like, you're fine with not interacting with them? Damn, that ending blows. Uh, we can see the ending of other people, though. Ruby Bell, after we embarrassed her, uh, can't, went to join a hippie commune where she's now happy. Uh... So the computer that uh, uh, was rebellious before now has a strong attachment to Jeffrey. Uh, he had to ask for a restraining order and look for a new home. Uh, taking over the psychic's headquarters, Cassandra declared herself the head of the guild. The soothsayer died just a few years later. She lived on in the memory of the members of the association who remember her as the most tyrannical and abusive leader in its history. Well, I guess you might as well go down to something, huh? Um, that street artist came back stronger than ever after a long hiatus. That's good. Uh, people think that she's got a bunch of imitators. And finally, uh, after the one sister graduated, they founded a technology company focused on the protection and safety of children. Wow. How sweet is that? We completed the path of the vaporized monkey. Cool. So I've gotten two endings to this game now, as I understand it. This seems to be the one where you end with high morality. Whatever. Uh, anyway, with that, you unlock, like, all these extra little, uh, settings that you could fuck with. If you, uh, discover all the cages, you can unlock free mode. I'm not sure what it does. This other one speeds up time. You can tell who's outside your door. And, uh, this is, like, the management of resources is easier. And I think that's pretty much it. Um, that's what you get for beating it once, anyway. Uh, I'm not sure what shortcuts... Oh, these are the control shortcuts, sorry. Uh, but anyway, that's been Do Not Feed the Monkeys 2099. I hope you guys enjoyed despite all the, you know, little hiccups we had. And um, I'll see you all next week. Later. <laughs>